Please welcome John Hiller. A couple of reasons. First of all, everybody says about 67 that's coming close, the riots, bringing the team together and such. But I think also when was 17 or 18 on that team came up through the minor league system together. So we've known each other. Uh, I came up in 67, scared young rookie, but I still I knew the Stanley, the Northrop, the McLean, the Lowell, just losing throughout the minor league system. So I think that made a big difference. And coming back, you know, 84 team just sort of walked away with everything. It looked easy. Almost. Uh, we came back so many times and we were nip and tuck with Baltimore late in the year, won a big series and then went on from there. But uh, coming back, I think 17 times, uh, eight Brown won ball games for us in the later innings. Uh, special group, but everybody would say that too. Amazing how things have changed. I think the leading person on that team with the city was five or seven. I mean, it just didn't happen back then. Things are so different now. Well, it is. You know, they run the team totally different. But, uh, you know, they had Danny McLean of Mayo came out and said, I'm bringing in Hillary. He'd say, no, you're not. Get back to the bench. So, I mean, uh, you know, we had three, four great starters when they had their stuff. Wilson, Sparma, Lowlich, and McLean. And uh, we had spot starters, Matt Dobson, myself, and the whole band started a little bit and relieved, and Daryl Patterson. So, no, there, there just was not the air of the saves. But uh, we all contributed in our own way. You're down 3 1 in the Cardinals, of course, in 68. You've got to stage that comeback. Was there ever a doubt creeping into the minds of the players that we can or we cannot do this? Well, you know, I, of course, we're always optimistic in that situation. But we were a team that came back. Uh, I've said often, I was a youngster making the minimum. Uh, we needed that needed that money. Uh, you know, we played for the money. Back then, we played for the love of the game. But that extra paycheck equaled my salary for the year, 8300 So, I mean, that was a motivating factor in itself. But I think we felt uh, that we could win the ball game. We had to go up against Gibson, and then when they beat him that second time, that was a, a tell story that uh, I think things are going to work out for us. So, so I was on an interview this morning early, and, and at our age now, we start, sure, we're glad to get back with the teammates and back to the city, but we start thinking about the people we miss. We've uh, lost probably a good dozen fellas from the 68 team, and uh, we start thinking more about the Pat Dobson, and, uh, you know, the Northrops, and uh, we have Bill and Freehan not doing well. So that's in our mind just as much as trying to celebrate this, uh, this year. Especially the pitching staff could get through all those games, how you could keep your arms in a condition to be able to pitch that much. What did you guys have to do to, to keep in condition? Uh, I, we didn't, I don't think we did anything out of the normal other than pitch. And I still under a belief, I was in the minor league system for a year, few years as a pitching coach. I had a very difficult time trying to teach what I didn't believe in. And uh, you got Mickey Lolich, Danny McLean, the two starters right here. Their arm was trained to go out there and throw 130, 140 pitches. Their mind was set at nine innings. Now, I don't think it's any different. Now their mind set six, seven innings, 100 pitches. Um, my wife and I sit at home and we have a little pool to see how many minutes into the game that one of them's gonna start talking about pitch count. I go, oh, here we go. Two seconds into the game, pitch count already. I, I really believe that the, the arm will condition to the way you want it to condition it. These fellas, if they did anything different, they did it behind our backs because we didn't see it, so no difference. I mean, I don't know how many people realize this, but John Hiller on our ball club that year won nine ball games in relief. I mean, uh, I mean a relief pitcher won the nine ball games. And, and the, here's the kicker. He used to pitch two and three innings when he came in for a relief uh, appearance. So it wasn't like he came in for a third of an inning and got a save and, and went to the bench. For our team, he was perfect. He put the same lineup in every day. The starters knew who they were. The bullpen knew who they were. And that's all there was. He was perfect for our and team. And you know what, Al? Bonus that you guys got individually for winning the World Series. $10,936.26. They make that now for $10,936. How much you guys get? They got $8,000. Oh, bullshit. That's what you cleared after it. They had to take taxes out. He's from Canada. He's got to count like one, two, three, four. And yep. no, we didn't take steroids either. Yes, sir.